Hi, this is Dawn Billings with Heart to Heart Media and Trova Business Network and the Heart Link Women's Network. And I'm here to help you understand how to blog your way to being found. Blogging is very, very powerful and especially if you know how to do it um, correctly. Blogging is actually easier than it's ever been before um, because there are so many places that you can go to blog. Uh, WordPress or TypePad or um, Preposterous or HubSpot, they all offer the most extraordinary content management systems that are very, very easy to use. So you can check into all of those blog, uh, blogging platforms and see what fits you the best. Um, now, if you don't want the stress of managing your own blog, because managing your own blog is a lot of work, you need to put up new, relevant, good content every couple of days, and so it's a big commitment. But if you don't have that kind of time, one of the things that you can consider is becoming a guest blogger on blogs that cater to your particular audience. So let's say that you had a health and children's uh, blog friend and you have health products for children. Well, you could become a guest blogger on her blog and teach the parents something really valuable and wonderful. And then you will have a tagline and information about you at the bottom. You can also create ebooks and webinars and get them to the right people. This really helps people discover you and your products, as, products and services online. Uh, when you consider blogging, put uh, your magazine publisher hat on. The goal of blog articles is to share industry expertise. Just like the same way you would in the column of a magazine. Don't use industry jargon. It not only confuses people, it bores them. Don't talk down to your readers. Actually treat them like friends. Become a member. Become someone that your readers really trust. Now, um, when you're choosing what to blog about, most blogs begin with a purpose. So think about what is your expertise. What information do you have and want to share? What benefits will your readers derive from reading your blog post? A great way to begin is to craft the 10 most common questions that you're asked by your prospective new customers. If you do this once a week and in 10 weeks you have the foundation for a successful blog. Uh, there is a list of ways to keep your blogging content fresh and exciting and I've written about it and so um, it, it you can uh, find that video and that article as well. You need to then consider how to convert your blog visitors into leads. It's important to remember that one of the most important functions of your blog is to convert your visitors and readers into leads for your business. This uh, requires calls to action. So where people um, are asked to share their email address or they download an ebook or they want more information. So you need to have places where they can click so that they can learn more. A great webinars and video email tool that I highly recommend is Calm F5. So you can go to calmf5.com and learn about it or contact me at support at trovanow.com and I'll be happy to send you all kinds of information about it. There are other types of content um, because while blogging is great, blog content is not the only content you should be creating. Uh, consider creating white papers, research reports, of course ebooks, webinars we spoke about before. All these can be used as lead generators and just make sure that you have great calls to action. So enjoy your videos, your slideshows, your webinars, your blogs. Happy blogging and I hope that you are found soon. Remember, Trova means find in Italian and we are dedicated to helping you find what you need to succeed and be found on the internet.